Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon for all the latest news and updates. Hello, you have logged into One India News YouTube channel and this is Mariam. 55-year-old senior journalist, editor and activist Gauri Lankesh was shot dead by unidentified assailants at the entrance of her home in Bengaluru on Tuesday evening. Four bullets were pumped into this editor of the Kannada weekly Lankesh Patrike at her doorstep when she came out of her car. The neighbors came out rushing when they heard the sounds of bullet firing and found Gauri lying in a pool of blood. The senior Kannada journalist was known for her criticism of Hindu extremism. She was known as an upright and honest journalist who spoke her mind. According to police, at least three suspects were involved and Lankesh was found dead on her veranda around 8 p.m with bullet wounds to her head and chest. Seven bullets were fired at her and three hit her. She was the editor of Gauri Lankesh Patrike, writing often against sung organizations and communal violence in the country. A colleague of Gauri, also a journalist, Ashok says that this is not the death of a journalist but the death of democracy and constitutional values. Gauri had raised her voice against communal violence with us and we know that all our lives are in danger, but we did not expect this. Ashok said, there was no doubt that Lankesh killing was part of a larger conspiracy to kill rationalist ideas. It is being reported that two CCTV cameras were in place. The police teams are working on the case and the footage is being examined. People began gathering outside Gauri Lankesh residence as news of her murder spread and protests started at the Corporation Circle in the heart of Bengaluru. In November, Gauri Lankesh was convicted by a court for defaming two BJP leaders for articles published in her periodical in the year 2008. She was sentenced to six months in jail and asked to pay Rs 10,000 penalty. Many journalists and various politicians have condemned this killing. Shortly after the murder, Karnataka Chief Minister Sidramaya expressed shock in post on Twitter. He said, this is an assassination on democracy. In her passing, Karnataka has lost a strong progressive voice and I have lost a friend. Congress Vice President Rahul Gandhi was also not far behind in condemning this killing. He took to Twitter to express his concern. India mourns the death of Gauri Lankesh. And this indeed is a great loss. That's all for now. For more news and updates, please subscribe to One India News YouTube channel.